26 meters. Well, this looks like a real lively location, and we're close to another traditional geocache. A traditional geocache. A traditional, and some members of our cruise ship already found this one. Then we should be able to find it, <laughs> Well, yeah, you never know. <laughs> we could DNF it, even though they could find it. <laughs> Let's check it out and see if we can get a find. Just you and I. Yeah. So, and hey guys! There you go. We miss ya. <laughs> it doesn't seem right, but. Uh, I think this is where it is. Yeah. So we had to enter kind of a, a beer yeah. garden place, hotel. hotel lobby, and it's in behind. So far, it's looking pretty cool. <laughs> so it looks like it's in there. So we found a way in, because there, right over there, is the rock wall we were on the other side of. So we just gotta find ground zero and the cash. I wonder if there's a bit of a, a pathway right there, but there's a trail across from the waterfall. See, there could be a little trail there. But there is a pathway across there. Yeah, but this is the rock. I think it's back there. Look at the trail. Yeah. Oh, it's no, I think it's in the corner. I think the rock. Suspicious looking rock. Uh -huh. Da, 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 da. That's it. Knock the nice. Look at that. Now I can see why uh, Magic Wanderer said it was the favorite geocache in all of Barcelona found. We're definitely going to give this one a find. A nice favorite point. Yeah, we just got muggled by a nice old couple. They were wondering, what are you doing? And, uh, what? They know what geocaching is. Yeah, they did. And, of course, I tried to tell them I was sweeping with my camera for dangerous pesticides over the fauna here, but they weren't buying it. Okay. Excellent. A great find. Love it. We're back on another side street, and we've got to go uh, three lefts and then up to the geocache, and hopefully we get another traditional. Check to see if it's that lane, or do we got to go up there? Yeah. No, it's not that way. Yeah, we go up the next one. No, no, we could go up. We, we could go, go up this one. This one, and then go across. Oh, okay. All right. It looks cool. Caching takes you to these really cool spots where you can see all kinds of interesting things that you wouldn't see if you're just taking the tourist lane.
Day you see a Hare Krishna parade. That's what I thought it was. Yeah, what it was. Haven't seen that in ages. I got it. Oh, good. It was under the lip? Nope. Oh. No, that's not it. Oh, that's, oh, shoot. Oh, yeah, I can see what you mean. Yeah, it looks like it, but no. This was an elusive one, and we thought for sure it was here, but with the hint on this one of metallic and garden, it's got to be down below, so we finally were able to find it, and we can log it. Good one here in Barcelona. And besides that uh, traditional, there's an earth cache right here we're going to take a look at and figure out what it wants us to do. And of course, we'll take a photo. We've come north into a huge park. Don't ask me to say the name of it. I tried, I wasn't able to. But we'll put the uh, description of it right here so you can read it for yourself. And this is amazing. There are three geocaches we're after here. One is a virtual, one's a traditional, and one is an earth cache. And they are all over 400 favorite points. It's completely amazing. And wait till you see what this virtual has you do. It has you take a picture of what's right in front of us, and it is amazing. The Basilica Sagrada Familia is a church that is still under construction. It is the largest unfinished Catholic church in the world. It was designed by architect Antoni Gaudi. Work began on the church in 1883, and it is still ongoing. It is a sight that will amaze and take your breath away. A very uh, not so muggle free area, and the muggle photo shows right behind at the bottom, underneath the crook. Oh, it's like that one in the uh, that, that fence with the J. J and yeah. Yes, yeah, so we got it, and it was really hard to feel. You really had to pay attention to what you were touching. Yeah, because it's angled. If you just put your hand under, yeah, you're never you going to feel it. it. And look at all the muggles we have to watch out for. You know what? Pretty much, we're invisible to them. They have no idea what we're doing. 
Because they're paying attention to what they're going to see, yes. not us. We're going to sign the log. Awesome. This geocache has what? many, 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 many has logs. This traditional, this traditional has almost 500 favorite points. 494 plus two. That is an amazing piece, eh? It's a beautiful piece of architecture. <laughs> the details on there are so storybook-like. It'll be so interesting to see how it ends up when it's finished, if yeah. it's true to the, to the design. And that architect has been dead for over 100 years, and it's still being built. Mm -hmm. Anyway, thanks for joining us here in Barcelona. It's been an incredible day with lots of fun geocaches. Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. Where will geocaching take you?